All right, so I'm really excited to be talking to uh, both of you because not only can I learn a lot and tons of other families, but, you know, right now is a very important time for us to learn more about vaccinations, right? Because we've been introduced to so many different things. Um, so, you know, why are both of you supporting this amazing new campaign, Don't Skip? Why is it very important to you? Uh, uh, Amy or Gabrielle, do you want to start? Sure, I'd be happy to start. Um, so we started thinking about la earlier last year, we knew that millions of doses of vaccines were being skipped by children and adolescents, preteens, teens. And we got really concerned at Vaccinate Your Family because um, unfortunately families do come to us and they've lost their babies, their children of all ages and unfortunately adults. And it's a sad, sad situation because we know it could be prevented. And so we started working on the campaign and we were so grateful um, that Merck wanted to collaborate with us and that Gabrielle Union Wade was willing to come in with her family. Um, and that's what it's really all about. N newer research is showing that the situation is even more dire. Um, more vaccines were skipped than we even thought. So here we are today and hoping to make amends and fix the problem. Yeah. Gabrielle, what, what about for you? Because, you know, being in the spotlight, and a lot of people might say, you know, are you doing this for the right reason? Are you doing this because of this? Are you doing this because of that? What is the reason that you came in and you're part of this uh, campaign? Yeah, no, between my husband and I and both of our daughters, we have large platforms. We, we know, we are very aware that we have the ability to reach millions and millions of people uh, using our platform. So if we can if we can talk about different products or show you our outfits, we can also give you information that 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 can for the betterment of public health. So when uh, the Don't Skip campaign, you know, approached us, we were like, absolutely, stay less. Uh, we're, you had us at hello. You know, any campaign that encourages families to get back into the doctor, get your well visits, ask your doctor if you've missed any of those doctor recommended vaccines, just to make sure we're up to date. School will be back in person in the fall this summer. Everyone's moving around. You're trying to travel. There's camps. There's all sorts of things. We want to make sure that you and your family and your loved ones are as safe as possible. And it starts with step one, reach out to your doctor. If you don't have a doctor, reach out to your local health department to find out if uh, your child has missed any uh, immunizations, any of those doctor recommended vaccines. So you are good to go come school time and you're safe as you guys are moving around. Um, as the world is opening back up, we don't want those diseases that have been prevented by vaccines to make their way back. Um, you know, Amy uses the word host in, in talking about these, these diseases, but hosts are people. Those are your babies. Those are your grandparents. Those are, that's us. So there, there is no uh, magic barrier when these when these very preventable diseases rear their ugly heads again, and they can be prevented by making sure that we're all vaccinated. Um, and that and that's just you know what something that's incredibly important to me and my husband. Um, and any time that we can use our platform for the greater good, we're going to jump at the chance. Yeah, I love it. And you mentioned these are our babies, right? So I have a six-year-old and, you know, I battled a lot of different things when I had him. Like, should I do this? Should I do that? Like, what's going to be the right thing to do? Uh, you know, with you and your shady baby, like, you have to keep her healthy, right? Um, so why did you choose, uh, becoming a parent, why did you choose to vaccinate her and give her vaccinations versus some people who say, you know, vitamins work or, you know, greens work and things like that? I mean, God bless. Uh, I leaned into what her doctor uh, said. Yeah. I, I don't tend to get my health care advice from the Internet or from social media. So my doctor, Kavya's doctor, they have all of our health records. They know our, any kind of pre-existing conditions that, that we may have and what is best for our health. So I lean into uh, our doctor's recommendations um, and, uh, and and healthcare providers to make those important healthcare decisions for me and my family. Um, definitely not gonna uh, rely on the family group chat for that. So I'm gonna <laughs> lean into health and science and and, and move move the way of truth <laughs> and uh, what's best for the the for for the for public health. Yeah, we know how that family group chat goes. Uh, Amy, if anybody wants to be involved in this and more information, uh, how can they, uh, you know, get more information on Don't Skip? Well, we have an amazing website, and I have to say, um, Gabrielle's authenticity is just so moving because her family became involved in this program. When you come to the website, you'll see some of the videos that have been created. There'll be social media involved. Um, she's right. I mean, you have to trust your doctor. And when someone with celebrity status of her family and the, and the visibility that they have says, trust your doctor, please. It's just so important to listen to them. Um, 
And I, and I do want to mention one other partnership that Vaccinate Your Family is working on, and it's it's with the National Council of Negro Women. Um, it is our major focus this year since the pandemic started, and we are going to be working with them um, in 15 states, creating millions of amazing Black women who are going to be educating their communities about vaccines um, and why it's so important for their overall good health. So that's just, I love my sisters at Good Health Wins. That's what we're calling our program. I love it. Good Health Wins all day. Yeah. Women's Immunization uh, Networks. And really quick before I let you go, because I know you're pretty busy. Uh, Gabrielle, congratulations on your success of Shady Baby. I love Thank it. You. I think it is an amazing for all our families. So just like this, you're helping out families all over. Uh, what can we expect in the near future for you and your amazing family? Oh, gosh. Well, my husband's show debuted last night, The Cube on TBS. So that was really exciting. Um, my, I just completed Cheaper by the Dozen for Disney+. Plus. I start a new movie for Netflix called uh, The Perfect Fine. LA, season two of LA's Finest just appeared this week on Netflix. And then I start a movie right after that called The Inspection for A24. We've got Flawless by Gabrielle Union available. I've got Bitsy's Brain Food. I, started, I launched a, a campaign for uh, Ford, a new truck called The Maverick. Uh, the most affordable pickup uh, on on the market. Um, we're really excited about that. But there's there's a ton of things. I've got the Fit On app. Uh, we're bringing back the New York and Company line, uh, affordable fashion. So we're there's a lot going on. Um, a lot of good things that we're really excited to share. All right. Thank you so much for your time. I'm excited as well about Don't Skip. Uh, thank you, ladies.